Hi everyone, today I am here to share with you a product review and kind of demo breakdown of the Boleto Studio Airbrush Foundation System. I was sent this by Boleto to review and kind of give my opinions and share them with you because I always, if there's something that I see that I feel like I need to kind of inform people or just kind of use so that I can share my experience and my kind of general idea and take an opinion on products it's great that I can share them with you so that in turn you're either not buying a product that you won't like that isn't doesn't work really well or um, something that just isn't really something that you really need so today I'm talking about the Boleto Studio airbrush system I have two other airbrush systems um, so I can kind of compare that to one I have the um, one of the MAC professionals use, which is I think the Iwata or one of those brands. And then I also have the Daenair um, airbrush system. And so comparing them to the Boleto Studio, the Boleto is super easy. Let me just bring my little machine over. First I'll show you what it comes in. It comes in a box, of course, and then it has this little case, which is really nice. So you can keep your um, airbrush system, your foundations, your blushes, or whatever you want to use for your face inside of this little compartment and it also has this right here where you can keep anything that you need and it also has some of those little things on the sides it has a water filler upper which I just uh, actually saw in this I didn't even know it had that awesome and then this can close up and then it also comes with this which your airbrush gun will go in and it's nice because it keeps your gun safe from getting broken or dropped or anything like that and the actual machine, I got the white one, let me bring it over, looks like this. It is just a small machine. It's probably, I don't know the exact dimensions, but if you look at it compared to my hand, it's rather small, which is really nice. This is the gun that it comes with, just your standard really nice airbrushing gun. And it has a little stand on the side for your airbrush to sit while you're not using it or while you're in between doing foundation or blush or clients. And on this machine, it has a very simple on off. So all you do to turn it on is turn the dial and you can see the light lights up when it is plugged in. And then you can kind of feel your machine getting some air out. And to talk about the machine, I'm just gonna kind of try to like go into this and make it as simple as I possibly can for you guys. So this is your gun. It's super easy. You just drop your foundations into here. You can adjust the airflow by the dial on the machine itself from very, very like soft air blow to harder air blow, which changes the dispension of your product. So lighter airflow is going to be softer, like less product. Harsher um, or harder air is going to be harsher product. It's going to have more coverage. And it also depends on how far you pull this little gun back dispenses less to more product. So that's kind of a rundown on the machine itself. It is a wall plug, so it just plugs into your wall. It's not bought battery operated, and it comes with a rather nice long, I know you can't really see it, but it's a long tube that attaches to your gun. So that's kind of just the breakdown of the machine, how it works, what it does, and let me just talk to you a little bit about some of the products that they sent me with it. So they sent me a little box of different types of things. They have a huge array of foundations, blushes, and a lot of other types of products. But I just wanted to focus today on foundations and blushes. So I got sent all of these babies. And I was sent four different foundations and then a highlighter and a blush. Now, the foundations are extremely liquidy. If you've ever seen Max Face and Body, it is similar to that just in the kind of like consistency that it's made up out of. If you can see, it's like, let me just pour it out onto my hand so you can get an idea of what it's like. Because it drops into the little canister on top, you need it to be liquidy. It's not going to be super thick or anything like that. So as you can see, it just runs down my hand. The great thing about this formula and airbrush type of things is that when I have it on my face like right now, I literally cannot feel anything. It's extremely matte. I can't feel anything. I don't need to set it with powder. It's just kind of there and I feel like it's my skin. That is really nice. And the formula, even though it's liquidy, it's quite opaque. 
and depending on how many times you brush that airbrush over your face is going to be how either translucent or opaque your foundation coverage will be. So saying that, yes, this is a buildable from basically nothing on your face to a full coverage foundation depending on how many passes and how much product you put on your face. So this formula is really great for problem skin, sensitive skin, really any type of skin because, let me just read it off my phone, it is free of parabens, alcohol, silicone, it's oil free and water based and it's also water resistant. So saying that, people like me who have acne problems, I feel like my skin just gets really clogged. I don't have to worry about this foundation going in and either having an oil base or silicones or parabens and just really kind of messing with my skin and the pH balance of my skin. It is a water-based product so it's really, really easy to just kind of get on your face, looks flawless, don't have to worry about it harming your skin or causing you to break out. If you look at the foundation on my face, like I have no oiliness whatsoever. Now obviously I just put it on, but throughout the day I really won't have to blot because the foundation is so matte. And the fact that it can go on within just a few minutes and I really don't have to do anything else except for maybe like my eyes, my brows, and my lips, which takes forever, the foundation part is the part that I don't have to take a long time whenever I use an airbrush system. The company claims that it is 12 hours and I really feel like it can go in with that really long lasting foundation because it honestly lasts for a very long time. That's why a lot of brides and bridal makeup artists and makeup artists really like to do this for special occasions because it feels so light on your skin. The formula, depending on what foundation you're using, can last so long and it just looks really flawless. You're not having to worry about stuff getting caked up or looking weird or getting like creasy with brushes nothing because air the airbrush is just like I mean I wish we could airbrush our whole bodies to make it just look perfect but we can't well not every day at least so I really honestly and truly like like when I look at my skin on my face the only thing is that I can tell is maybe in like the areas that I have a little bit of more pores I needed to put a pore filler but I did not because I wanted you to see just the plain foundation without anything any of my primer sprays or pore fillers or primers this is just straight onto my skin so you kind of get an idea of what it's going to be like now i would have liked to like gone in with my professional and just put that in this area because i do have problems with big pores so you know i just know how to take care of it and i like the combo when i do use them together I think that if you like to maybe have a little bit lighter of foundation or if you have like problems with acne or breakouts or things like that, the great thing is is that you're not using brushes so you're not having to worry about bacteria in your brushes. It's just going straight from your gun to your face. That sounds really funny, but it's awesome. I have a code down below. This was sent to me for review, but you guys know I'm always gonna give you my 100% honest opinion on these things. I feel like in comparison with my Dane Air as well as my um, professional makeup airbrush, I feel like this is an awesome kit. I feel like it, could, it meets the standards of what I feel like I need in an airbrush system. As well as the foundations and the blush, I feel like those products are really great. I like what they are on my skin. I don't feel like it's going to make me break out. It's not going to last and it is, you know, it has that pigmentation to it. So I definitely recommend this system. I have a coupon code down below that you can get this system for $75 off using the code Lexi May, which is again down in the description box. And then I also have another coupon code that you can get 20% off the entire website depending on what you want to get because they have a lot of other great stuff there too. Thank you so much for watching and please go and check out the demo that is going to come up next. And if you have any questions about this system or about airbrush systems, please leave a comment in the comment section below so I can answer anything that you would like to know about anything with airbrush. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! To use this airbrush system, it is quick and easy. Just grab your foundation. I'm using a mixture of brulee and bisque and add about 10 drops total into the top of your holder on the gun. You can see it sitting right in the little holder part in the top. Then I'm going to turn the machine on to about halfway. This is going to give you a really nice continuous airflow. And using your gun about six inches away from your face, so just to show you guys, you wanna use it about that far away. 
you're also going to use circular motions going across your entire face. Holding the tang at the top, I'm just going to start by doing circular motions all around my face from forehead down onto my neck. And I'm going to be doing a half of my face so you guys can kind of see what it looks like in the coverage and then I'll continue on to do the rest of my face. Now you can see what the right half of my face looks like with the airbrush and the left is without. So I'm just going to continue to do the other side of my face using circular motions always. And now I have it across my entire skin. I'm going to show you kind of before pictures, after pictures, and then side by side so you can see exactly what it looks like. So this is before. This is after I have all the foundation on my skin and then this is a side by side of a before and after. And then completing the rest of my look with my makeup. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this demo and review. Don't forget to check out the description box for all of the codes and information.